Hi guys, today we're going to be making bread pudding made with croissants. Just take the croissants and break them into little cubes. And I'm going to make six cups of this bread. All my croissants are cubed up and I put them back in the container. This is a lot more than six cups, but we're doing a big batch. So we're just going to adjust the recipe as we go. You can use Italian bread or a baguette or any bread. Um, bread pudding is supposed to use like stale bread so you can reuse your bread and you don't have to throw it out. But we have croissants that were fresh and we put them in the freezer and now we're making bread pudding. So I've got my oven preheated to 350 and I got all my broken up croissants in this dish. Now I'm going to need four cups of milk. I have a massive measuring cup here. So I need four cups of milk. No way, that's awesome. I got four cups of milk and I have three tablespoons of melted butter and I need three eggs. One, two, Ooh. it's plopping in there, three, three eggs, and I need two cups of sugar, Ooh. so half a cup. A little shy of half a cup. Three, four, and a little extra because it wasn't completely full. So I've got that done. Then I need two tablespoons of vanilla extract. One, two, and I need pinch of cinnamon and now I gotta mix it up I have one apple washed and diced um, pretty small I'm just gonna pour it over the bread now we Spend use it. apples why because nobody likes raisins. Not in our family. <laughs> Some people, use, most people use raisins. I'm using apples because apples are delicious. Now I'm going to pour my mixture over the bread. Wish me luck. Bake this for one hour at 350. Okay, we'll see you when we get back. Just took my croissant apple bread pudding out of the oven and it's ready to eat. Mmm.